Oh no, oh no. Did you eat my leftovers when I told you not to? Mmm, so yummy. You're so annoying. I told you I was going to eat that. Gobble, gobble. What are you, a turkey? You are not funny. Stop. What is wrong with you? <gasps> glizzy gobbler. Did you just call me a glizzy gobbler? Okay, blink if you need help. Ooh, too spicy. Have you blinked at all today? Thank you for the gift. Am I in a simulation right now? <gasps> glizzy gobbler. Please, please stop calling me that. Anything but that. Why are you moving your arms like that? Is that a dumb bitch? Excuse me, I am not. Are you being possessed or something? Mmm, I love ice cream. Okay, that's it. I'm calling the police right now. I can be adopted by a billionaire or a baker. Hey, what does billionaire mean? It must be someone who has like a billion friends. Wow, okay. Oh my, why have they given me a clearance child? And what are you wearing? I don't know. Go put this on this instant. This seems fancy. Yes, well, it's better than the Walmart clothes you're wearing. Much better. And this is our butler, Gerald. He'll take care of whatever you want. You have to get me anything I ask for? Yes, miss, that's right. Can I have an electric guitar? Yes, I will get on that right now. Here you go, one electric guitar. Sweet, thank you. So, what do you do for a job? Uh, I run a very big business. What kind of business? This is not bonding time. You don't need to know. I will not answer any personal questions about myself. Now go sit down for dinner. The private chef has made a five course meal. For dinner tonight, we're having escargot. Isn't that like the bottom of a plane? Oh my, no, that's cargo. Escargot is snails. Snails? I don't wanna eat snails. Then you may have some caviar instead. What's caviar? Well, it's fish eggs. Do you guys have, like, chicken tenders? No, of course we do not have chicken tenders. Bro, you're seriously eating a snail right now. Good for you, Slay. We're going to need a tutor to fix your grammar immediately. What's wrong with how I talk? You sound like you have three brain cells total. Tomorrow you will be starting at a private school. Cool. At my old school, one of the teachers got arrested for money laundering. Okay, let's not repeat that again. It's a school for the rich and talented. Every person there is gifted. I am neither of those things. This will be your uniform. There's a uniform? Of course there's a uniform. It's a private school. I'm gonna look like a dork. That's great. I hope so. You look so much better. I look silly. Well, that's because you didn't button it up all the way. See, isn't that great? This is worse. Now, now, we have to get going. Class, this is our new student, Bailey. Hey, guys. Hey, isn't your father crazy, Mr. Carlson? Mm, I don't know. He seems pretty nice to me. Do you know what he does for work? He won't tell me anything about his job. Yeah, because he does super illegal things. My father gave me Wagyu when I asked for escargot. Can anyone trade? Mm, no, I can't. How about you, new girl? I have a Lunchable for lunch. Anyway, have you been down into your basement yet? The basement? Yeah, dude, everyone is always talking about what he keeps down there. No, I didn't even know that we had one. You need to go down there and tell us about all the crazy things. Like what? I'm assuming you had a great first day of school. It was fine, I guess. Have you made any worthy friends? You could say that. Can I ask you something? Of course, as long as it's not about my job. Well... No, you are not allowed to know any information about my job. I cannot tell you. Why can't I know? You're my dad. It's hard to explain, but it's none of your business, okay? You are forbidden from asking me any more questions about my job. Fine, I got it. I have to find out where that basement is. I've checked every door in here and none of them lead to a basement. Did that bookshelf just move? No way, this is a secret entrance to the basement? I mean, he's still in his room. What the hell is all this? What are you doing down here? Uh, it's forbidden. I was looking for a bathroom. I can take your order when you're ready. Can I just get a number six? Of course, is that all? Yeah. Uh, we give out a free dum-dum with each order. Thanks. Hey, what can I- Wait, weren't you here yesterday too? You remember me? I don't think I could forget. Let me guess, you want to get a number six. How did you know? I have no idea. It must have been <laughs> luck. And here's your dum-dum. Have a good day. Thank you. Oh, look, it's my favorite customer. Stop, you're making me blush. So, what's your name? If you don't mind that, I'm asking. It's Bailey. I don't mind. My name's Lucas. You should try the number one instead. It's my favorite. You know what? Sure. Enjoy the dum-dum and have a good day. You too. I can help who's next. Oh, hi. Where's Lucas? He moved to a different location. He doesn't work here anymore. Um, do you think you could tell me the new location that he works at? No, I can't disclose that information. Sorry. 
Could you move if you don't mind? There's people in line behind you. Wait, but what about the free dum-dum with each order? I'm sorry, we don't do that here. I'm never going to be able to find him again. There's like 300 locations just in my area. Are you excited to start your new job today? Yes, I can't wait to meet everyone. You'll be amazing, don't worry. Thanks. Hi everyone, welcome to your first day on the job. I'll give you guys a few minutes to get to know your co-workers. Um, excuse me, have we met before? I'm not sure, I don't think so. I'm sorry, it's just that you look really familiar for some reason. Maybe we met before or something. Well, anyway, my name is Bailey. I go by my middle name, Will. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, everybody, it's time to get started with the work day. See you later. Yeah, of course. Whoa, did you design that by yourself? Uh, yeah, I did. It's beautiful. You have a lot of talent. Thank you. I appreciate that. Now that I think of it, I definitely remember you from somewhere. I'm sure we'll figure it out at some point. Hopefully. This is going to bother me for the rest of the day. We were lucky enough today to get a catered lunch for every single one of you. <gasps> they have dum-dums! <laughs> Um, uh, Bailey, is something wrong? Lucas? <laughs> really? That's it? Who even cares? It's just hair. This game is such a joke. Sis, can I do something for a task? Yes, but why do you have scissors? I need to cut your hair. Why would you need a piece of my hair? Hmm, I don't know. That's <laughs> creepy. Why would I do that? I mean, if it wants me to, I will. Where are you going with my hair? Uh, don't worry about it. It's a task. The last ten are the hardest. Be careful. I'm really not worried about that. DNA results will be back in three days. Okay, thank you. Hi, um, I'm here for my results. You're the girl from three days ago. Come with me to the back. Why? I'll tell you when we're back there. Listen, you are not who you think you are. I'm sorry I'm not following here. Do you know the story of that lost royal family? Yeah, who doesn't know that story? Your DNA matched up with the queen. What? Don't tell me you think I'm royalty. There is no what if. Your DNA lined up perfectly. Just let me see the test. I cannot give this to you. I'm sorry. Why? I it's confidential. You just can't have it. But I need it. If I give you this document, you have to rule. Rule what? You have to give up your everyday life and rule all of us as royalty. I guess I really don't have a choice. Do not tell anyone you got that from me. Okay, I won't. Break in! I'm going to get arrested, thank you. They left the door open? Idiots. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Ma'am, what are you doing in here? Um, housekeeping... Yeah, right. Wait, no, please, I can explain. I am a princess. Oh my god, you're right. Your eyes. My eyes? My eyes? What do you mean, my eyes? Come with me right now. We have something to do. Okay. Uh, where are we going? We're going to walk in there and stop the family meeting. Oh, we're going to what? I mean, we can't just barge in. That's, like, rude, right? No, the crown must go to the rightful ruler. <laughs> Everyone, the lost princess has been found. <laughs> Hi. This is ridiculous. I mean, look at the way she's dressed. She's emo. Who says a princess can't be emo? She's not fit to be royalty with that attitude. But look at the color of her eyes. That can't be. They are almost identical to her mother's. Her mother? Guards, I want this girl out of here right now. I'm going to overrule you guys. You can't just proclaim things like that. Well, I just did. She's kind of badass. Apparently, I am the rightful ruler, and I want to take that place. That's not going to happen. I don't believe you. I need proof. Fine. Show her my DNA test. But this test says that there's two from the royal bloodline. Two? What do you mean, two? Do you have any siblings? Not half ones. Yeah, I have a full sister. There's no way. You both are royalty. What? How is it possible that both of you ended up together? I don't know. We were left on a doorstep. Your sister must agree to rule with you. Mm, there is no way my sister is going to do that. Well, who wouldn't want to be royalty? Her. Yeah, she's kind of a bitch. 
You must at least try. Okay, but I'm warning you, it's not gonna work. I'll be back in with my sister to overrule you. Whatever, get her out of my sight. Mm -hmm. Sis, I have something to tell you. Okay, that didn't sound good. You know how we were adopted? Yeah, of course. Yes, yeah, so we're actually part of the Lost Royal family. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I already knew that. I'm sorry, what do you mean that you already knew? Oh, because we were left with a blanket that had the royal crest on it. And you didn't think to tell me at any point. No, because I don't want to be royalty. But you have to be. Where is this all coming from? How did you find out? It's part of my task, okay? We both need the money. Just come with me. We won't need it if we're royalty. I'm so close to finishing, please. Only if you give me 25% of the prize. Fine. Oh, uh, you're back? Yeah, I am. And you brought your sister. Sup, motherfuckers? Tonight we will have the ceremony to officially crown you guys. Tonight? You guys cannot just kick us out like this. <laughs> it's already too late. Congratulations, you are now crowned. This is the craziest thing to ever happen to us. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Do I have to keep this on like all the time because it really hurts my head? Hey, what do you think you're doing? Uh, uh, nothing. You are a terrible liar. You know you can't go outside until you turn 21. But why? I'm 18. Isn't that close enough? No, you're not going outside. I need to know what's out there. I'm going to work. Don't try anything while I'm gone. Okay, see you later. Why is there nothing good on Netflix right now? Who's there? That's definitely not my mom. Bailey, honey, listen to me. There's somebody inside the house. I saw it on the cameras. You have to leave now. But I can't go outside. It's just this one time. The police are on the way to save you right now. What do you mean they'll save me? Okay, this is it. I'm going out the window. Wow. <coughs> Ooh. Hey, you can't touch anything. Why not? You can only touch three things today. I don't understand what the big deal is. You have to save them in case of an emergency, okay? I'm sure it'll be fine. You can only touch your own body or things you're already wearing. I know. Everyone take out your textbooks and open to page three. I can't. You can't touch anything again today, Bailey? Just how it is, I'm sorry. You can follow along with what we're doing on the board. Hey, do you think you could hand me a pencil by any chance? No, uh, I'm sorry. Why not? I can see that you can touch three things, just use one of them. No, I'm sorry, just ask someone else. I want you to do it. Hey, what are you doing? Let go of me! Look, it's not that hard. Bitch, did you just slap me? Yes. You're gonna regret doing that. Reason? Reason of what? Sorry, I forgot to tell you. You have to pick the reason you die. I don't want to choose the reason that I die. You have to. We all do. Well, it's definitely not gonna be by drowning. I'm gonna pick the most painless one that I can. Good luck. I don't think any of the options are good. Murder? Oh my god, that's way worse. No. Can this give me an option that doesn't suck brutally? <laughs> Bailey! Oh, sis, what's wrong? I didn't pick a reason in time and it picked one for me. What? It picked one for you? Apparently you only get three choices. I didn't know that. I'm so scared to ever get into a car again. I'm so sorry. Be careful with your choices, okay? I will. Please just give me something painless. I don't remember anything that happened last night. Where am I right now? Welcome to your escape room. You must complete five tasks in order to leave. What? I don't want to play this game. You must play. Let me out of here. If you fail to complete all five tasks, you will not be making it out alive. What can you hold in your right hand but not your left? I don't know. My left hand. That wasn't so bad. There is no way I am doing that. Please just let me out of here. Okay. That hurt. What now? How am I supposed to give myself a tattoo? No. 
She's back and with more fashion trends from the 2000s that we have to bring back. Listen, hear me out for one second. The denim on denim is kind of hot. I love it. Especially in like this couple's aesthetic and with the necklace, I'm obsessed. I will now be buying a denim corset. Track suits, like why did we ever stop wearing these? They're so cute and you don't have to put any effort in because it already matches. I'm gonna buy this, but in hot pink. Just everything about Christina Aguilera, the gloves, the chain, the hats, I love the hat. Obviously I already did the braids too. I think they're so cute. Also just everything Avril Lavigne did. Like, are you kidding me? This is the coolest thing I've ever seen. I have these arm cuffs and I bought a tie because of this look. I'm obsessed with cargo pants and I'm very glad that they're coming back into style. Let me know what trends you missed from the 2000s because I have so many more. These are some trends from the 2000s that we need to bring back immediately. First of all, the black and white hair. It's just so good. I wish I could do it, but I'm afraid I'm gonna burn all my hair off. Somebody else needs to eat this up and tag me, please. You might wanna argue with me, but low rise jeans and hear me out. As someone who is not very tall, this makes my torso look so much longer because I have children sized legs. The crimped hair, mwah, mwah. why did we ever stop doing this? I kind of love the texture. It's fun, it's crazy, it's messy, but on purpose. Last but not least, okay. <laughs> this, this whole aesthetic. The belt and the cargos and the bracelets, yes. I would literally wear this tomorrow if I had all of this. Comment a trend that you wanna see come back. I can't punch someone in the face, that is so mean. Wait, but for a thousand dollars, who's my victim? Hey sis. Uh, yeah, what's up? Remember that one time you stole my white blouse and got hot sauce all over it? Um, yeah, I remember that, I said sorry. It's time for my payback. Dude, you broke my nose. Yes, I'm rich. What's next? I want to buy myself a Chanel bag. You want me to cut someone's ponytail off? I'm sorry, but for 10K, I have to. Mom, I'm so sorry for what I'm about to do. What? What do you mean? Did you just cut all my hair off? Uh, yeah, looks like it. If I have to be bald, so do you. <gasps> I'm sorry. What? I can't do that, I'm gonna get arrested. I'll help you finish the challenge if you give me half the prize money. <laughs> really, that's it? Who even cares, it's just hair. This game is such a joke. Sis, can I do something for a task? Yes, but why do you have scissors? I need to cut your hair. Why would you need a piece of my hair? Hm, I don't know. That's <laughs> creepy. Why would I do that? I mean, if it wants me to, I will. Where are you going with my hair? Uh, don't worry about it. It's a task. The last 10 are the hardest. Be careful. I'm really not worried about that. DNA results will be back in three days. Okay, thank you. Hi, um, I'm here for my results. You're the girl from three days ago. Come with me to the back. Why? I'll tell you when we're back there. Listen, you are not who you think you are. I'm sorry, I'm not following here. Do you know the story of that lost royal family? Yeah, who doesn't know that story? Your DNA matched up with the queen. What? Don't tell me you think I'm royalty. There is no what if. Your DNA lined up perfectly. Just let me see the test. I cannot give this to you. I'm sorry. Why? I it's confidential. You just can't have it. But I need it. If I give you this document, you have to rule. Rule what? You have to give up your everyday life and rule all of us as royalty. I guess I really don't have a choice. Do not tell anyone you got that from me. Okay, I won't. Break in. I'm going to get arrested, thank you. They left the door open? Idiots. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Ma'am, what are you doing in here? Um, housekeeping. Yeah, right. Wait, no, please, I can explain. I am a princess. Oh my god, you're right. Your eyes. My eyes? My eyes? What do you mean, my eyes? Come with me right now. We have something to do. Okay. Uh, where are we going? We're going to walk in there and stop the family meeting. Oh, uh, we're going to what? I mean, we can't just barge in that. It's like rude, right? No, the crown must go to the rightful ruler. <laughs> Everyone, the lost princess has been found. <laughs> Hi. This is ridiculous. I mean, look at the way she's dressed. She's emo. Who says a princess can't be emo? She's not fit to be royalty with that attitude. But look at the color of her eyes. That can't be. They are almost identical to her mother's. Her mother? Guards, I want this girl out of here right now. I'm going to overrule you guys. You can't just proclaim things like that. Well, I just did. She's kind of badass. 
Apparently I am the rightful ruler and I want to take that place. That's not gonna happen. I don't believe you. I need proof. Fine. Show her my DNA test. But this test says that there's two from the royal bloodline. Two? What do you mean two? Do you have any siblings? Not half ones. Yeah, I have a full sister. There's no way. You both are royalty. What? How is it possible that both of you ended up together? I don't know. We were left on a doorstep. Your sister must agree to rule with you. Mm, there is no way my sister is going to do that. Well, who wouldn't want to be royalty? Her? Yeah, she's kind of a bitch. You must at least try. Okay, but I'm warning you, it's not gonna work. I'll be back in with my sister to overrule you. Whatever, get her out of my sight. Mm -hmm. Sis, I have something to tell you. Okay, that didn't sound good. You know how we were adopted? Yeah, of course. Yes, yeah, so we're actually part of the Lost Royal family. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I already knew that. I'm sorry, what do you mean that you already knew? Oh, because we were left with a blanket that had the royal crest on it. And you didn't think to tell me at any point? No, because I don't want to be royalty. But you have to be. Where is this all coming from? How did you find out? It's part of my task, okay? We both need the money. Just come with me. We won't need it if we're royalty. I'm so close to finishing, please. Only if you give me 25% of the prize. Fine. Oh, uh, you're back? Yeah, I am. And you brought your sister. Sup, motherfuckers? Tonight we will have the ceremony to officially crown you guys. Tonight? You guys cannot just kick us out like this. <laughs> it's already too late. Congratulations, you are now crowned. This is the craziest thing to ever happen to us. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Do I have to keep this on like all the time because it really hurts my head? Fight? Girl, I cannot fight anyone. Have you seen me? You have to complete all five levels in order to win. And if I don't? Oh, then you die. Have fun. Wait, I am not ready. You're just as ugly as you were back then. My bully from middle school? The top you're wearing is hideous and I hate your tattoos. You're never going to be better than me. Listen, just because you hate yourself does not mean you can take it out on everyone else. We did not do anything to you and you're just jealous that other people love themselves and you can't. What? I love myself? I won? I have been waiting so many years to say that. Oh, level two can't be that bad, right? Hey, baby girl, how are you? Oh my god, not you. I waited outside your house this morning, but you didn't come out. Listen, I know I've been nice to you, but I don't actually like you, and you need to take the hint, okay? Please stop hitting on me and showing up to my house. It's weird. You don't like me! I could actually win this. You'll never win against me. 